walk at France Park and wanted to point out all the swimming rules and regulations because I am a swimming rule and regulation girl. But let me tell you, not a single one of those was followed yesterday. There were dogs on the beach. There was plenty of jumping. There was no lifeguard on duty. Uh, there was no lightning, so that one probably I guess that's it, but none of those rules were followed. In addition, there's no alcohol at this park, but let me just tell you the glass and bottle caps indicate that there is alcohol. That's all I got. Let's go. Uh, we're at the top of the waterfalls here at France Park. We're gonna walk down, well, we're at the top, kind of. And we're gonna walk down the rest of the way to the waterfall so you'll see the scenic sights of the waterfall of France Park. Let's go. Let's go! We are at the top of the waterfall. That's it, we're at the top of the waterfall. Hope you enjoyed it. dump station. Dirty little secret nobody in camping wants to talk about. But this is where you leave a dump. It's not really take a dump, it's a leave a dump station. There are no potent potables here. There are definitely potency, but there's no potables. So apparently you just, um, <clears throat> I've never had the pleasure, nor do I want the pleasure, of dumping the poop. Apparently goes down, it goes Apparently it goes down there in that little poop hole right there. I'm not I'm not even gonna walk over there. I don't even really want anything close to anybody else's E. coli. So that's it. That's what we got. Alright, so the rest of the tour on this campground we have the playground here. And some dangerous toys. Although I don't have one of those things that we used to have where you sit on it and spin around and get off and puke. I don't have that. Kids today. Then we have uh, a little mini golf. One of my least favorite things to do is mini golf. But I, don't know. Uh, I have yet to see anybody mini golfing. Now, it may be that it's closed until Friday like the camp store, which is over yonder. I just don't know, but there's the mini golf. So plenty of amenities here. This is a camp store. I don't know who Kenneth is, but this is his depot, potentially. As I mentioned, <clears throat> it's closed. She closed, we, we arrived here yesterday about noon. What day was that? July 5th. What day of the week? Monday, which was a holiday for many. But at noon, she had just closed up and she doesn't open again until Friday at 10 or something like that. So. If you're out here and you need something, well, you're SOL. Or you have to drive into Logan's Port. But if you have a camper like we do, that's not the easiest thing to do. So, you're SOL. Here's a camp store. All right, we've finished our morning constitution. I'm not yelling. So we're gonna do a little tour of the campground. Start here with the water. There's a water source. It doesn't work. This one does. A different kind of water. So we're I-4. Here's our passage by safari. <clears throat> Campers all set up. Here's our camp fire, I guess. The, uh, what's that called? Awning. <laughs> the awning is intentionally left like that. So don't comment. I don't need your smart ass comment. Oops, can't say that. 
uh, it's done that for the condensation. So, not sure what else. I guess over here. Over here is our electric down there. See, 50 amps. We have a little surge protector to prevent surges, to protect us from surges. If this were crowded, we would be back to back to back with neighbors, but most people have pulled out because it's July 6th, which by the way is the anniversary of the day that I just met this person who's filming me today. So, happy anniversary. That's our campsite. What else do you want to see on our campsite? What? Love you. Yeah. Sign off. Signing off. Got to take the dogs out for a whizzer, so more to come.